baked openly. Might be a couple of games that we've seen in recent years do that. Rivals 2 ain't about that. We are out here making sure this game is all well and polished for that full launch in December-ish. I can't remember exactly, but shouts out. And now we are ready to raw Cheesy Potato already lighting up BD Bean with a clean 50%. And man, those up tilts are coming through trying to extend those combos. And why not, right? It's one of the best combo tools in the entire game. Even still looking for the command grab there to push you off stage, find an edge guard attempt, doesn't find it yet. Tries to reset once, twice, three times, but right now the big problem is BD Bean not able to find a way back down onto the ground, but who needs oh to find a way back gosh. down when the earth is coming up to meet you? Jin, that was just about as brutal a stock as we've seen today. Yeah, that was not a moment to waste for Cheesy and uh, BD laughing off another stock. And you, you know you what? You said a moment to waste and, and uh, yeah, Cheesy no. said, uh, yeah, no, you're right. <laughs> oh, we're chain grabbing, which by the way, chain grabbing, I did learn this today. There is chain grabbing in the game. You just have to do a normal pummel before it will give you a smaller lockout window, which is very important, especially for Krag, which makes his pummels very threatening because the neutral and the special pummel, of course. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm clumping you up for the for the cargo throw and I am dumping you off this stage or I do the normal pummel. And now I get a chain grab you. And so it's a very gross 50 50 you have well, to play against. It's not, though, necessarily either, because you know, I guess it it is, but it isn't, right? Because there's still the chain grab ability, and, but you have, remember how the grab early system in this game works, right? There's no mashing here in Rivals 2. Yes. Ooh, ooh. When they press their pummel button, if you press the same pummel that they chose, which is either, right, their mm -hmm. normal spa pummel or their special pummel button, and we're seeing now BDB and saying, okay, game one didn't go my way, let's rebind the controls, right? You... <laughs> You immediately pop out of the grab. So, oh, oh, yes, there are chain grabs in the game. Yes, you get a smaller lockout window after that normal pummel. But if they're just doing it over and over, you can just press the A button and well, you'll yeah, pop out. That, that's, why, that's what I'm meaning Absolutely. by the 50-50, right? Because mm -hmm. it's the 50-50 of, is Cheesy I'm going to go it. for the special pummel for the cargo throw? Mm -hmm. Or are they going to go for that neutral pummel for that command, for the uh, for the chain grab, right? And so for BD Bean, he has to play the scary side of that of like, do I have to fight with you just mixing me up on this? Or you might not even go for the pummel and just throw me. And uh, BD Bean gonna be throwing that stock right off stage. Yeah, G BD Bean just like not even able to try and find a recovery there. It does just feel BD Bean, you know, not necessarily as used to the controls of the game quite yet. Right, and just trying to find it, but having an opportunity for an advantage state, they're not able to keep it going there. Cheesy just trying to reset the situation once, twice, three times, not gonna find it, so BD Bean finally, this is the first advantage state we've seen from BD all set long in, but it's not gonna last as Cheesy Potato pushes you back to the ledge, and this is where BD Bean has lived. Yeah, and it's been a nice little 97%, and look at that, the poison bubble, Still on this crag, allowing for even more percent. BD gonna be dropping that stock now, though, and Cheesy up to 101. Come on, BD, we could get a stock here unless Cheesy keeps this advantage state going, which she is. Look at that forward air and uh, gonna be popping the block as well. Double hit. BD really trying, but that's gonna be it. Yeah, and the cover to the space and that Cheesy was able to control with that block, with that. You know, Boulder was immaculate. So good, right, at the re-grabs. So good at understanding when you need to th to throw it to catch your opponent and directly versus when you need to use it to lay in their space and then hit them yourself for a bigger follow-up. But yeah, I mean, can I just say yikes? Because that one, that one <laughs> was a little brutal. <laughs> oh, just a little bit. That, look... I, I don't I mean I don't know what to tell you, bro. I mean, you were fighting one of the best in the business, so I get it. Um, but yeah, look at that. Cheesy just dishing out, gets the block again. I'm spiking you down, sending the message. And Cheesy just understood exactly how to reset the scenario time and time again, didn't allow them out. And because of it, once you were in disadvantage against Cheesy, you were stuck there until death. 